there are over 40,000 visually impaired adults in Utah. One third of them live in poverty, and many have little or no health insurance. The Moran Eye Center provides charity care for thousands of patients every year, and our doctors donate their time for everything from routine screenings to surgeries. For no saber cómo sea la, la visión, pues con ver hacia adentro, ver sin, sin poder ver, pues todo tenía que ver adentro o le tenía que preguntar a alguien cómo puedo ver en la. No podía hacer nada, pues. Rene is a wonderful young man who lost vision, was unable to read, unable to uh, continue in school, and unable to work because of a very advanced uh, corneal uh, uh, disease called keratoconus, and that had led to a severe scarring in both of his uh, eyes. I really felt bad for Rene when I first found out that his vision was really bad. They said that Rene would probably be blind in four to five years if he didn't have a transplant. In America, fortunately, we don't have that many, you know, fully blind people. You know, we people who have you know, low vision and uh, you know, really don't see that many people out in the street being led by a stick. You don't see as many guide dogs. But here in America, it's a huge trend towards other problems once people do lose their sight. Pues, independ independizarme, pues, no puedo pedir ya ayuda al maestro cuando tiene cosas en el pizarrón o en la computadora o trabajo que tengo que pedir notas a mis amigos o al maestro y ahora ya puedo invitar a mi ser yo solo, no, puedo sacar la, la tarjeta para conducir o jugar deportes, antes pues, no podía jugar deportes porque no podía ver o jugar golf, pues o cosas de, deportivas pues. There's just a huge population in America unfortunately that has no insurance and can't afford the cost of uh, medical care and we can work to uh, try and prevent people from losing their sight. The patients I see at the free clinic are generally patients with fairly significant eye diseases. They're screened quite well. Most of the people we see in the clinic are adults with severe diabetes and diabetic retinopathy, patients with uh, tumors, with ulcers, with advanced cataracts, and we work to try and get them the best possible care. Dr. Tabin is an exceptional person. Um, the whole, I have to say the whole staff up there that I've been involved with, they've made us feel like as if they were helping one of their family members. No puedes sin visión, no. No puedes jugar, no puedes ver, no puedes ver el sol cuando te levantas, no puedes ver la luz. Y la luz, pues, son las cosas más importantes, es un don que te da, pues. Get you set up here. Good shot, Renee. Let's do another one. 